Hola, hola. Hola, hola. ¿Cómo están? ¿Cómo están haciendo? How are you guys doing today? Um, I am back with another video. Okay. Follow up update on the Kiki Palmer case. If y'all have been sleeping under a rock, don't feel bad because I stay sometimes underneath these rocks and I'm always kind of late sometimes to do my psychological analysis on these cases. There's so many of them. Like, it's, it's really legitimately insane to me. Um, Just the amount of stuff that keeps coming out for celebrities like i don't know if y'all have noticed like i i'm i'm wanting to do another video on why we should stop having celebrities we shouldn't have celebrities because it's so disgusting what these people are up to behind closed doors it leaves me without words okay this is just one of the thousands and thousands of stories that keeps coming out. I don't even know what to say, but let's go ahead and dive into this story, okay? So Kiki Palmer, for those of y'all that don't know, long story short, Kiki Palmer was in a relationship with Darius. I don't even know who he is. I've, I've heard of Kiki Palmer. I know who Kiki Palmer is. I don't even know who Darius is till now, okay? Because his name is all over the internet and all over social media for being, I don't want to say the A word, but for being, you know, a woman beater. Allegedly. <laughs> right? Like, like, you're supposed to say allegedly, right? Because, uh, you know, who wants to get sued? I don't know. But it, I believe it because there's more than enough receipts out here on the internet showing yet another male who is out of control. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we've got here because y'all, when I tell you that this, um, this story is cray cray, I mean, this story is cray cray cray. Now, before I actually like show this, I'm trying to figure out I'm trying to figure out what we're going to do about this problem, right? Like, this is really what I'm trying to figure out. Like, what are we going to do about the problem that we have? Because um, the next, sorry, I'm trying to pull this up for y'all. The next um, a video that I'm going to post, we're going to take a look at a research article. Okay. In that research article, we're going to take a look at raw data um showing just how bad it is when it comes to males unaliving females and unaliving their children we have statistical data that shows that it is actually a national crisis okay so i don't i don't know if y'all knew it's an, it's a national crisis and it's a it's a worldwide crisis as well so there's a center that overlooked oversees um, male violence against women and children for the world, basically for like countries, right? At a, like countries, there's a center that does that. And they have issued it a world crisis, like a world epidemic um because of the rate at which males are unaliving women and children so we will be taking a look at that data most definitely because it's insane y'all it's insane over here so let me see let me see let me see well what have we got here okay so let me go ahead and let's 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 what's the tea What's the T? What's the T? What's the T? All right. So let me share that with y'all. Yes. Okay. So we here live in color. Let's take a look because it's been getting crazier and crazier 
with this case, okay? It's been getting crazier and crazier. A couple of days ago, we knew that it was going to be messy. But girl, I don't think even Kiki herself knew that things were going to get this messy. Kiki's mom literally <laughs> exposed Usher for being gay while she was trying to drag Darius. And when I tell y'all that things are getting out of hand, there's so much messy drama to uncover here, so let's break it down. Kiki's baby daddy, Darius, has started fighting back at her DV claim. Y'all, it feels to me like any celebrity who is a male is literally gay. Is that just me? Or, I mean, I don't understand. Like, all celebrities that are males, it's coming out now that they're gay. Celebrities, athletes, they're all into all this weird sexual things. It's so weird. Like, Usher... Oh, and y'all might have known, but I didn't know that Will Smith was gay. I did not know that. It turns out Will Smith is gay as well. Um, turns out, allegedly anyway, allegedly, allegedly, all of these people are gay. That's what the news is saying. Tur I mean, the news is also saying that Dee Dee, he's into some weird things. And he's also a woman beater. That's We covered that. If you haven't watched my video review on that, Go ahead and once this video is over, go ahead and watch my video review on Dee Dee being a woman beater um, because it, it recently came out and Cassie sued him and blah, blah, blah. So go ahead and watch that video if you haven't, right? But it's like, what's going on? Like all of these high profile males are, are it's turning out that they're gay. <laughs> It's so weird. Like, is it just me or what's going on here? Anyways. And he is fighting dirty. Kiki still hasn't said anything about the situation or even released an official statement. In fact, the only reason we even know about this in the first place is that the court documents leaked online, especially her restraining order where she said, it is because of our son Leo that I was finally able to end my relationship with Darius once and for all and escape the mistreatment. Leo is the most important thing in the entire world to me. He needs and deserves to be safe and grow up in an environment free from violence. Unfortunately, ending my relationship with Darius has not ended his I wonder how like I wonder what it took for her to finally leave because from the research that I did on this case every like there were a lot of people telling her hey this guy seems to be abusive it might not be a good idea for you to stick around Whenever I cheat and I go and I get something, I didn't get a full meal, but I always get like the small, the kids, the kids um, from the kids menu. I just got small fries and a small drink. So whenever I cheat, that's how I cheat. And <laughs> so that's why if you're wondering why it's so small, that's why. But anyway, I wonder what it took for her to get out of this relationship, y'all. So think about this, right? Because... From the research that I did, a lot of people were telling her already that this guy was no good. They were already warning her. They were already telling her like, hey, this guy is no good. You know, there's no reason. There's no purpose. You need to leave him. And guess what she said? She said, mind your business. So she told like she said, mind your business. It was very, very like the response was giving me very, very mind your business vibes <laughs> i heard that interview too when when she was asked about it and she told everyone to mind the, mind their own business i guess in this case we could still mind our our business still i mean she's doing what she has to do um but i, I it does make me wonder you know what made it to where this was the last straw because you've been you've been he has been putting hands on you this whole time this whole time i wonder if he 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 did it so so much worse this time that she just couldn't or i don't know what the deal is his mistreatment if anything he is even more unhinged volatile and dangerous to both me and our son but while kiki has been silent darius and his family especially his brother Saronis, has been making a lot of trouble for kiki because they have been accusing her of all sorts of why is his 
brother, like the toxicity, what y'all need to remember is that whoever is toxic came from somewhere, right? So most likely, especially if you're still with this person, think to yourself, what do I want for my future? Because if you're significant other is a toxic person, then guess what? The rest of the family is probably toxic as well. Okay. It's like 95 to 97%. You could be 95 to 97% sure that it's not just going to be him that's toxic. It's going to be him and the rest of his family. And if you're thinking of having a future with someone you have to understand that you're not going to be having a future with that person alone. Um, you're going to be having a future with, I'm trying to pull up this article because I want to show you guys. You're going to be having a future with that person, with him and the rest of his family. Okay. And if he doesn't talk to you, so psychologically, right, you have to understand that this is how it works, human behavior, okay? If he's not close to the rest of his family, if he doesn't have the, a relationship with the rest of his family, be just as cautious because what that means is, you know, something's going on there. So you're going to have to ask even more questions. And also... um. It, it doesn't really mean that he that it doesn't really mean that the apple didn't fall far from the tree just because he doesn't have a relationship with his, the rest of his family. Actually, it could be the opposite of that, right? It could be the opposite of that. So psychologically, I want you guys to think about that. Okay, I want you to think about that before getting into these really, really weird situations. Okay, I'm going to share this. This is going to be my go-to for y'all. You're going to love, love, love these statistics. Okay, so thing. For example, Sarunas did a tweet and delete where he said the most disgusting, bow, manipulative person I have ever encountered in my entire life almost everyone y'all will see just send positive energy to the baby any child in the middle of something like this does not deserve it at all wow so darn sad however kiki's mom sharon was not about to let them paint a picture of what is he talking about so he doesn't address the fact that his sibling is a woman beater but he wants to like say oh the fact that they're having to go through this battle is so bad for the child what about the fact that your sibling is a woman beater and has been beating his mom in the same environment where that the child resides? I'm, I'm very confused as to what the sense is there. So psychologically, you're trying to gaslight and manipulate us as if we're we don't have brains of our own to to think about the fact that that doesn't even make any sense right all these games psychological games that these people try to play crazy of her child in a negative light so she went live on instagram to call out sarunas and she revealed that his entire family knew about how darius was treating kiki but they all turned a blind eye for sharonis jackson to post on his twitter uh, uh, the ridiculous stuff that he's posted when he knew his brother was abusive. I went to Sharona's over a year ago and told him that his brother was to my daughter. And he said, uh, well, I used to be like that too. What? She ate Sharona's up real bad with that. So he and Darius decided to release footage of Sharon. That's crazy. So the mom, so this is what I was telling y'all. Okay, keep in mind that it psychologically speaking, we're tying in the psychology here because that's what we do on this channel. We look at the psychology behind these types of cases. We also, a lot of times, we'll dive into the biology. We'll also dive into economics um, if needed because a lot of times those things come into play as well. Um, so 
I'm just saying that because we're diving even further into the psychology here. So I, this is what I mentioned earlier. So for you, if you're in a relationship with a, a male and he's treating you badly and you still stay with that person, the number one question I want you to ask yourself is what kind of future do I want? Think about what you want for yourself in the future, because you're not just with this one person. Okay. You're also with the rest of the family. And if this one person turned out like this, then you can only imagine what the rest of the family looks like. Okay. Cause you're going to get a double dose of that and that's going to be your reality. And that's your future because you don't get, you're not getting that time back. That time is not coming back. So you better make sure. Threatening Darius. Where's my baby? You better, you better watch out. Where's you might get a bullet in your I don't know what he was trying to achieve with that because the video only confirmed that he had been treating Kiki badly and he is now in full damage control mode because he just released another audio of Sharon threatening him. But not only did he make himself look even. Oh my gosh. It's like males are delusional like completely delusional. They do these things like thinking that the rest of the world is stupid. Okay, so if you've watched my videos, you know that my percentage of um, useful males versus alpha, uh, useful males versus non-useful males. So non-useful males versus alpha males. Uh, I think in the whole world, there's maybe one to 3% of alpha males, AKA useful males, males that, um, are able to fight, fight their inherent nature every day in order to continue to evolve and be better people and human beings. The rest of the 97%, I'll be making a video on how you can tell the difference. The net, the, cause, cause I'm starting to see that a lot of ladies don't even know how to tell the difference and that's a problem. But the rest of the 97% junk. So, so he's getting on video acting like it's a good idea and people are so dumb that they're not going to see through it and acting like being a woman beater is justifiable insane worse but he also ended up outing usher of all people because in the audio we heard kiki's mom say that usher is on the down low in the audio that he leaked to dj academics we heard kiki's mom say that his mama messed him up and turned him into a man who hurts women what kind of force is that your mama should be ashamed of herself her mom why are you this girl Kiki then clipped in and said he calls her horrible names even in front of their son. You know, there's no need to say horrible things and send me this usher picture. There's no reason for that. You do that because you're nuts. There's no reason for you to say that. Jezebel, calling me Haiti. That's all necessary. You do all of that unnecessarily because something's wrong with your mind. But Darius was not moved in the least because he then said that he was going to take their son away from Kiki and he didn't care. I'm his dad. I don't care about what you all think. I don't care what you think, especially Kiki. I don't care about what anybody else thinks. Sharon, your opinion is very little to me. You're, you're, you're wasting your breath right now, Sharon. You're, 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 you're wasting your breath right now. You're wasting your breath right now. Trust me. At this point, Kiki's mom was getting frustrated and she said that she was going to start her Darius back and then dropped this bombshell. Dude, well, now, now I'm going to not normal. It's not necessary. You could just not talk to me. I'm going to you. Up to his bisexual. He sleeps with me and you stupid. Uh, Usher is what now? Yay? Say what? And it wasn't a slip of the tongue because she said it one more time. If you going to talk about my daughter, you going to Mom even your family don't even understand the this is wild and i just know that usher is out there somewhere wondering why they brought his name into it like he is just sitting around minding his business and somehow he's having his pro <laughs> so y'all she's so right you know usher sitting there like <laughs> That's all right, Usher. 
you know what? I'd much rather these celebrities just be upfront with what they are and who they are. So that way it's not a story later on. Because psychologically, if you're not, when you're upfront about something, I'll give you guys um, some psychological training here, right? A, a little, a little something. When you're upfront about something to people, then it takes away psychologically it takes away the uh, curiosity which means it also takes away the excitement okay so if you ever want to get make sure that you know, you don't get in trouble for something or then something doesn't come up later and bite you in the butt just be upfront about it just be upfront about it. Then, I mean, then it's not going to turn into this whole thing or this whole start story. This to me is a story only because it's like, okay, uh, we did not know that. <laughs> we, we did not know that. But I mean, we're in, we're in times the twenty twenty three we're more accepting of these things and so he's in a better positioning so i don't even think that he should speak on this um i don't think he will it, it would be a waste of his time i would just feel like whatever you know but i don't know why y'all insist on bringing my name up i don't understand <laughs> but ladies if you had any type of a crush on usher there you go allegedly he gay so move on okay <laughs> <laughs> this is why I say celebrities, they're not really anything. Like they shouldn't really be celebrities. They're just regular people. And so I'd much rather influencers than celebrities, right? It's like at least influencers, we get that. We get the point that they're regular people, but celebrities, people psychologically always want to put them on this pedestal when everyone's just the person. Everyone's just the person. <laughs> Usher's probably like, I mean, <laughs> I don't even know how Usher came up in that conversation, y'all. Did y'all hear the transition? I didn't hear the transition. I don't know how, what Usher has to do with anything or how he came up. If you heard the transition, leave it in the comment below because I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's going on private business air out in the front of the world he's probably wishing that he didn't serenade kiki that night because that's what got his name pulled into this and the thing is this is not the first time that usher has been accused of being on the dl i mean he was basically raised by diddy who is the poster child of dl men in hollywood and there has always Oh my God, I just said his name. I just said Diddy. I was like, he's a woman abuser and apparently he gay too. And these males don't age well at all. What is that? He did not age well at all. Super ugly. <laughs> what? What is this? And he and you rich, you supposedly have all this money. Why are you aging like that? In my opinion, in my opinion, in my opinion, if y'all think that looks good, that's that's you do you, girl. But I don't always been talk about how Diddy allegedly did things to Usher as a kid. Usher is known for being reluctant to talk about the things that happened to him while he was living with Diddy and he never addresses it in interviews. Usher had an interview with Howard Stern where he opened up about what it really was like living with Diddy and heads up it wasn't exactly kid friendly. Place was like just filled with chicks and orging like non-stop right? No nah, not really I Come mean on. but did I, hey it was curious I got a chance to see some things. Yeah but you were 13 what were you I seeing? I went there to see the lifestyle. Right. And, and I saw it and it was, and it was, <laughs> but I don't know if I could indulge and understand what I was even looking at. It was, it was pretty wild. Okay. I, I didn't say you, that. <laughs> what I did say is that there were very curious things taking place uh -huh. and I didn't necessarily understand it. Uh -huh. He then revealed that he would never do the same thing to his kid. You're a dad now. Would you ever send your kid? to puffy camp <laughs> <You Hell know? laughs> no. See? so kiki's mom saying that usher likes men isn't exactly surprising because these rumors have been around for years and i don't know about y'all but i believe that darius left that part in the audio on purpose because he could have either cut it out or had DJ Academics blur it out. Darius knew what he was doing and this is his way of getting back at Usher for having the audacity to serenade his baby mama. A hot mess. However, Kiki's mom- Oh my goodness. Narcissistic behavior. Narcissistic behavior. 
I don't even know when that serenading happened or how long ago it was, but I agree. He probably left that in there on purpose because he could have blurted out. He could have had it taken out, but he was probably like, whatever, I don't care about that dude. But I don't care about that dude. Like, let people know, let people know what he really is or whatever. Narcissistic behavior. He feels like he owns her as though she's an object to be owned. Okay. Um, that's crazy. Like, y'all, I'm going to make more videos because we have to not have these celebrities be celebrities anymore because the things they do, like I said at the beginning of my video, epically gross. Like, Usher was 13. You know what allegedly that means? Allegedly, that means Didi is doing some things that aren't appropriate with a minor, allegedly. I don't know. The whole thing is not it. And like, that's why even Beyonce, if I, if Beyonce were to walk to my doorstep right now, I'd be like, oh, cool. Beyonce, I like some of your songs. The things for singing those. It, it wouldn't, I would, that, that's it. Like literally it wouldn't be, oh my God, oh my God. I would feel nothing because I've heard so many things about them too. Oh my gosh, I've heard so many things about them, especially them con in connection with Aaliyah. Have y'all heard about that? Leave it in the comment below if you want me to do a video about that. But leave these celebrities. They're not, y'all need to understand these are not, they're worse than even regular people. The things that they will do for fame, the things that Usher did just to be famous, just to be, just so you could be famous. You, you sold the entirety of your life, right? Did things that you can't get over psychologically because you wanted fame and money. Was it worth it? I don't know. Maybe. Depends on him. Mom also came out to deny that Usher is gay, claiming that she was lying. She said, the lie I told about Usher was to get Darius to stop hurting my daughter on account of his jealousy. So I said he didn't like women for her safety. Everything else I meant with my chest and didn't expect anyone to hear it because recording me is illegal. I guess he is okay with jail, but I knew that when he put his hands on my daughter. He is still hurting her in all of this, trying to paint him. She wasn't lying. She just don't want to get sued. <laughs> but if I were Usher, I wouldn't even bother. Like, I'm not getting in between that. This story will be the next story tomorrow. And being gay is not a thing that's like that anyone really cares about in 2023. <laughs> so he doesn't have to worry about it as far as that goes. Will Smith, Will Smith, he gay. I think I said that earlier in my video. Allegedly, allegedly, right? It's crazy, y'all. It's crazy out here as a victim textbook behavior people feel like Sharon is only backtracking because Usher was getting clowned on social media over being outed and she felt bad about it so she tried to do some damage control also the fact that Darius is still hurting Kiki even with all this shows that he is truly not sorry Darius got dragged for filth and fans left comments say so he went there provoked them then recorded their reaction and acting as if it's all about the baby literally none of this is working in his favor Kiki business has never seen the light of day until she started messing with his dumb self and now usher catching strays lord i know usher wish he never went near kiki's section at his residency and i feel so sorry for usher why is he being dragged into kiki palmer's and darius's bs again leave him out of it so what do you guys think about kiki's yeah leave leave usher alone for god's sake don't nobody care about that that's not news in 2023 well it is news because we didn't know so we might be, we probably like, oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> so for all the ladies that were crushing, stop crushing. He gay, okay? But apart from that, I mean, <laughs> y'all need to leave Usher alone because of y'all's, whatever this is, hot mess, okay? Now, women, ladies... A yet another example why you shouldn't stay with a male that's physically hurting you, that's mentally hurting you, and then on top of everything, tell people to mind their business.
Yes, this is not unheard of behavior from, especially from ladies that are being mentally manipulated or hurt. Um, society doesn't help either because society keeps trying to tell women that they have to be in these relationships. They have to have kiddos in order to have any worth. They have to da, 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 da. And when, when women do these things, they end up finding out it's not true. You did all these things and you're still unhappy. You did all these things and they still, they treat you even worse than when you were single. Cause now you got to deal with him and you got to deal with the kid, the, the kiddo. Right. Um, so let me know what you guys think. Okay. Leave it in the comments below. It is craziness over here, but we will keep covering the story. Okay. Um, but I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.